morning nights and welcome to the Westmount Highlights. It's the week of April 13th, 2020, and we're trying something a little different for this episode. When the TWH crew started this YouTube show, we wanted to develop a fun way to keep students and parents informed about what was going on in our little community. And also highlight... Okay. And also highlight some of the great things our students create on a daily basis. Keeping this community connected has never been more important. So, we're dusting off the old camera, putting out the bat signal to all of our TWH crew members, and putting together a weekly show that will be posted here on YouTube and on all of our social media platforms. This week, I've invited one of our students to join me on a video call to see how she's keeping busy during this period of social distancing. She's also gonna demonstrate how she logs onto the ePortal at the EMSB website. And later, we're gonna highlight... Is this gonna be a thing? And later, we're gonna highlight some of the incredible work that you guys have been doing from your homes. But first, let's get Hannah on the horn. Hi, Hannah. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Pretty good. All right, awesome. Everyone's healthy, everyone's good? Yeah. What have you been up to? How have you been keeping busy over the, over the past month? Well, I've been mostly staying home, obviously. Um, uh, I've been mostly studying at home, kind of keeping up with the schoolwork. Yeah, and our family's been going outside for like an hour every day to exercise, to stretch, to kind of run around, you know? That's great. And I've also been cl playing my clarinet more than usual. Okay. And also piano. Excellent. So yeah. you, that's great. You, you, you're doing uh, everything you should be doing. It seems like mm -hmm. you're busy. That's excellent. Why don't we, uh, do you have your, your web browser open right now? Yeah. Okay, cool. So if you want, um, why don't you click on the button that says share screen at the bottom there. Did it work? It's loading. All right, and okay, so, so just, if, if you don't mind, why don't you demonstrate how you get onto the ePortal? Yeah, just type EMSB, ePortal. Oops, portal. Yeah, and right here it says ePortal.EMSB.QC.CA, this one. Yeah. You click sign in to EMSB, and you see this page. Okay. So you just basically have to use your EMSB email and password to log in. It's all written on your report card. If you have mm -hmm. your report card, you can definitely check on your report card. And if you don't have your report card, you can email any of your teachers or have your parents email any of your teachers or email me at mshapiro uh, at emsb.qc.ca. I'll put that up on the screen. Um, okay, so so you did that. Why don't you uh, go ahead and log in? Okay, yeah. So it leads to this page, ePortal. So here you have like these many resources that, that you can use like during your isolation, right? Okay. For example, there's this EMST virtual library. Okay. So if you want to read a book but you, you can't go to the library, you can always go to this virtual library to read books. I've used that. It's really cool. You can, yeah, you have a lot of uh, excellent resources on there, including audiobooks, I believe. You can actually get mm -hmm. them right out loud, which is super cool. Yeah. And, uh, and so how do you check your actual email? It, so it's the webmail button there, I guess? Uh, yeah, so you click on the webmail. And this yeah. is where you're getting all the communications from your teachers? Well, I, I, don't, I don't think it's actually, okay, wait. You said you sent me an email. Oh, because you didn't. Okay, so you actually haven't even set up your email. I don't think so. Well, that's okay. uh, wait, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna check. I might have. Uh. You know what? So see, this is why we're doing it because we want to. I want to show everybody how to actually do this. So. Yeah. So you, it's really important. You do have access to all these Google uh, uh, applications. Right, like mm -hmm. Google Drive, Google Classroom, Docs, all that stuff. But you don't have Gmail. It's the only thing basically oh. that you don't have. But oh, we, I we, thought we had. Oh, yeah, okay. no, I, that's why we have ePortal. A lot of people think that, and that's why you couldn't find it in that when you went to the to the top right. Mm -hmm. cool. Yeah. But when you go here, click mm -hmm. on my webmail for me. Yeah, my webmail. All right. I kind of have to set it up though. That's okay. So you're gonna click on the right. It's in Korean. <laughs> no worries. It's it's pretty self-explanatory. So yeah, click through this. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. This is even 
better because now I can show everyone how to set up their uh, email. Exactly. Better. Oh, okay. here it is. So, uh. here, so this is where you're going to get all your emails uh, mm -hmm. for futures. Uh, and so you can see there's a few that, that, that have been sent out from last week, but you're already in Google Classroom. So you were checking a lot of those things through Google Classroom. But the great yeah. thing about, and the, the really important thing is your email, all of that information, all of the Google Classroom updates, all of your um, mosaic updates are gonna be sent as a notification to your email. And so you can yeah. enter, check, you know, on a daily basis or on a, you know, whenever you want, uh, you can check what assignments are being posted or what messages are being sent out that way. Okay. Why don't we talk about how to like access the resources on the EMSP website, maybe? Yeah. So we'll just go to EMSP. So if you just go into the website, mm -hmm. like on the very front page, it says a new space for educational resources. If you click. Very cool. Like they have so many resources for like everyone. So for us, like there's just like these links to other websites that you can go into to like learn more about each subject okay. and it's right here or you can also go into these online QEP based content mm -hmm. so you basically have access to your online textbooks mm -hmm. and this one is EMC weekly activities so there's, mm -hmm. there's a lot to choose from right you can see there's yeah. a lot of different things to, to keep mm -hmm. excellent there's also MES open school so you can choose any one of them so let's try to go into the secondary school education Okay. So it's just, they have like every single subject, literally every single one of them. Anna, thank you so, so much for doing this. Uh, I, I, you know, you're the president and CEO of uh, the Westmount High Highlights. Uh, so, <laughs> so uh, you know, I, I knew I could count on you to, to show, uh, to walk us through some of these different uh, uh, resources no that we have online. And, and, and again, I'm really happy that... Uh, that uh, everyone's healthy and that you guys are doing well and you're taking lots of walks and you're, you're, you're busy uh, through all of this. It's good to see you, Hannah. It was good to see you too. Good to see you, Hannah. And, and uh, we'll see you hopefully sooner rather than later. We, uh, hopefully this won't last too, too long, but either way. I really miss school and all my friends and teachers. Yes, and they miss you too. I, I know they do. So, uh, all right, Hannah, thanks again, eh? No problem. Once again, I want to thank Hannah for helping us out today. As I mentioned, if you have any issues logging into your portal, feel free to contact me at this email address. Now, let's take a look at some of the incredible things you guys have been working on. Thank you, Hannah, and to everyone who submitted work this week. And courtesy of our spiritual animator, Jag, here is this week's Mindful Minute. From our makeshift studio, we're wishing you all good health. Be well.